Dear students, welcome to the video lecture of static storage class. The static storage class variables they are having a unique feature. They are able to retain their values between the function calls. Static storage class. A static variable tells the compiler to persist or save the variable until the end of the program. The value of the variable is saved until the end of the program. A local or a global variable can be a static variable. Static local variable is declared within a function or a block. Its lifetime is till the program terminates. A static local variable is declared within a function or a block. Its lifetime is till the program terminates. Static global variable is declared outside of all functions. Its lifetime is till the program terminates. Its lifetime is till the program terminates. Static global variable is declared outside of all functions. Its lifetime is till the program terminates. The default value is zero. The default initial value is zero. It is stored in a data segment of the memory. The static storage class variable they are stored in the data segment of the memory. We'll see an example. Okay, here we are having a, the same program static storage class. Static variable are declared using the keyword stat static keyword. Static is the keyword. Okay, so I'm having a, a, a same program. Okay, with static variable and without static variable. If we take a left side as she include sdio.h okay is the header file why it test is a function okay within the main i am calling this function three type okay the why test don't have any return type and don't have any parameter i am calling three times in the test function i am initializing it static integer a equal to 0 a is a static local variable a equal to a plus 1 and print of percentage d slash t uh, comma a with the first call the static variable is initialized only once okay they will not reinitialized after that okay static integer a equal to zero first time the integer a equal to zero is initialized a equal to a plus one print of percentage d comma slash is at app space a one get printed okay the second call that cannot come the initialization cannot happen because it is initialized only once a equal to a plus one percentage d slash t the percentage d slash t a it prints value two okay now third function call a equal to a plus 1, a is become 3, print of percentage d slash t and uh, a, I am giving the value is 3. So the static variable is retain the old value between the function calls. Okay. The same program is given here. The static is not given. Okay. If static is not given, it is auto. Okay. Auto integer. The same program I am calling three times. What is my output? Okay. Every time it is initialized, a equal to 0, a equal to a plus 1. 1 is my output. Okay. Second call. If you come, lock, okay, stat, automatic variable will initialize on every time. Okay. Uh, and again, a equal to 0 is initialized. a equal to a plus 1. Print of percentage d slash t. Again, a equal to 1. The third call, again, same like this. Okay. Initialized and a equal to a plus 1. a is become 1. Print of percentage d slash t. a is become 1. Okay. We will just run the example in the code box and check the output. Environment and check the output. Okay. So here, I'm having a I'm having a wide test. Okay, the declaration function prototype and why it mine three times I'm calling this function. Okay, within the y test, I'm, I'm declaring integer a equal to zero, a is a local variable, a equal to a plus one. I'm okay, I'm uh, increasing it and printing it. Okay, okay, the output is become one. Second time I'm calling it because it's auto integer, the value is one. Third time I'm calling it, the value is one. Okay, we will run the program and check whether it is correct or not. Yeah, yes, every time. The value is one only. Okay, so the same program I'm, I'm making a the same program I'm making a very small change. Okay, what I change I'm making I'm making I'm the declaration I'm making static. Okay, I make the small change, nothing else. Okay, I'm just change it as yes, a static. Okay, the integer is a no static variable. Okay, it is a Static okay variable now okay we will we'll, I will we will run the program and check the output yes see the output the value is one two and three every call first time it is initialized and every time 
it retains its old value and a is incremented and value get printed so we are having a value 1 2 3 so that is a specialty of the variables in the static storage class they may be declared as a local and declared as a global also okay the lifetime is till the program terminates okay that's it uh, for the video lecture and thanks for watching it